How about this for a restaurateur's dream? To open up at a new location and be immediately embraced by the community and diners near and far. Join me in Pleasant Ridge as I visit Cork Wine and Pub. Today I have the pleasure and honor here at Cork to meet with general manager and one of the founding partners, uh, Joel Rubin. We call ourselves the Wine Pub because a pub connotes how comfortable we are as opposed to maybe you would think a wine bar would be a bit stuffy. So a pub is comfortable. We even price our wines comfortably. We have a much lower markup to be accessible in the neighborhood to go out several times a week. Here at Cork Wine Pub, we have three layers. We have a very well thought out wine program, small, mostly small batch production wines, priced affordably so you may come in three times a week and not break your bank. We have a craft cocktail program to have much more interesting cocktails that you would, than you would find elsewhere. And our gastronomical program is beautiful yet recognizable food that is fresh and from good farms. Bree Hoffman, what a pleasure to meet you. Thank How are you. you, good. Good? I was lucky enough to be involved in this project from the beginning, uh, from the ground up. This restaurant was nothing like you see it now, and everything from the floor to the ceiling was created by me and the other owners. The menu includes many items that pair well with um, our drinks and wine bar here, so I try to incorporate um, all of that into the food, nothing too sweet or too salty, things that are you know, enjoyable for the palate. So we have some liqueur, we have some grape going into the food. Oh, definitely, as much as possible. As much as possible. As much as possible. <laughs> Um, I guess I just have to say that it is definitely American based, but um, it's very eclectic to try to pick up some things from people in my family, friends, ideas that people give me and kind of morph them into things that fit into our wine bar. With those ideas, let's start on the food. Okay. Amherst Egg. Mm -hmm. The only other restaurant in Pleasant Ridge is on Amherst. It's Maze. It's a breakfast diner. Cut a flank steak as seasoned, and then placed on the grill. Eggs are poached. Brioche bread made on site is toasted. The flank steak is grilling as a poached egg is done boiling. Blue cheese crumbles are placed on the toasted brioche. As the poached egg settles over the toast, the grilled steak is added alongside a helping of bacon to round out this original taste of breakfast. A touch of herb puree made from basil and parsley is added to finish off the Amherst egg entree. Fantastic. This Thank is you. really, really good. Thank you. I really love the butteriness of the, of the brioche. Poached egg is perfect. Next, something that I've been looking at on the menu all day. Salmon with dirty potatoes and all day sauce. Another popular item at Cork is their take on salmon. It starts with a plump piece of organic, farm-raised Scottish salmon. It's sprinkled with salt, placed in a pan over medium heat. After being seared, the salmon is placed in the oven for about five minutes. Next, pre-blanched potatoes are cooked to a crisp. Along the way, seasoning and Kalamata olives are added, turning this into what's called dirty potatoes. The salmon is flipped for even cooking, the dirty potatoes are removed from the heat and placed into a mold to form the base for this entree. Chef Brie pulls the salmon out of the oven and places it on top of the potatoes. All day sauce is spooned on the side of the plate. It contains 20 different ingredients it takes all day to make. A mix of greens and olive oil make up the garnish, which rounds out this inviting dish. Multi-layered. Go ahead. I'm not even going to try to guess. What's in it? <laughs> it's uh, based with red peppers and tomatoes. It has ginger, garlic, shallots, tarragon. I uh, can't give away everything, but those are the right. basic ingredients. Oh, very hearty. Yes. Very, very, very mysterious, I'll have to say. Pairs well with the salmon. Yes. Great job. 
The chocolate cake. It's not a plain old chocolate cake. Definitely not. But it's a, a great example of incorporating the grape with the food. Mm -hmm. One of the great aspects of Cork Wine Pub's menu is the fresh dessert offerings which are made in-house. A favorite is the chocolate mousse cake. It's served on a plate drizzled with red wine reduction. The chocolate chiffon cake layers are stacked between layers of maricabo chocolate mousse filling. The outside is covered with a shiny chocolate glaze sprinkled with cake crumbs. A homemade chocolate garnish tops off this luscious dessert. Wow. It's one of my it's, favorites. It's heavenly, ethereal, whatever you want to call it. Yes, it has to be. It's very it's good. It's my favorite now. <laughs> it's very good. Chef, thank you again. Thank you. What a pleasure to meet you. You too. And we'll see you later. I hope so. Cork Wine Pub is purposely casual, comfortable, fun, yet sophisticated. We purposely wear jeans, so you're comfortable to wear jeans, yet you'd feel completely at home to be dressed to have a drink on your way to the theater here. And that's who we are. That's it from the Cork Wine Pub here on Woodward Ave in Pleasant Ridge. And for more information on this restaurant and others, join us at diningindthed.com.